who was hiding behind the name Shakespeare? For 400 years. <laughs> who wrote Shakespeare? The Earl of Oxford or the man from Stratford? One man changed history. Another man got the credit. The courtly works of Shakespeare were written by a commoner? <laughs> I don't think so. Shakespeare was at times hyphenated. Among the nobility, this signified a pen name. Oxford was known as a literary genius who needed the disguise of a pseudonym. Pallas Athena, she was the spear shaker who always wore the helmet of disguise. Shakespeare was obsessed with loss of royal privilege. The young Earl had led 140 horsemen all dressed in black across London Bridge, a spectacular show of his power and status. Never again to be repeated. His children would one day carry on that fine family tradition. They could not read or write and would have to use a mark to sign their names. The offspring of the soul of the age? I don't think so. What they told you in school doesn't make sense. This has been hiding in plain sight for 400 years. Will you look at that? The real Shakespeare Edward de Vere, the 17th Earl of Oxford, is not just plausible, but fascinating and wholly believable. The biggest and most successful fraud ever practiced. At long last, we can discover the truth behind this fascinating mystery. Worth exploring. Evidence has been hiding in plain sight for 400 years.